guys. This is a very nice technique that we use. You've got these athletes or sometimes middle-aged folks or younger folks, anybody. They come to the clinic and you flex their knee and they've got some pain around that joint line. The end feel a little firmer, a little bit different than the other side. And pain, pain at the end of flexion, at the uh, interline of the knee. So what you can do is move the tibia in relationship to the meniscus. Why do we do this? Because in flexion, your meniscus move posteriorly on the tibia. So since we can't just mobilize the meniscus posteriorly, what we're going to do is place the patient toward the, uh, the flexion. And as we place the patient to the flexion, I place my hands here. And what I'm going to do is pull on the tibia. So I place my hand on the thumbs on the condyles, and I pull on the tibia forward. And I can do a little rotation if I want to emphasize the posterior horn of the medial meniscus, translating anteriorly the tibia and a little external rotation. Translating like this. And then at the end, what you can do is ask the patient to do a gentle isometric. Just pull your heel towards your buttock and relax. And then, so that will move the meniscus, then what you can do is just recheck. Ooh, better end feel, great technique, simple Monday morning for people with joint line pain and uh, terminal flexion.